Welcome to the Game Audio Resource Wisecube 2019 Audio Implementation Guide Series. This guide will highlight how to implement environment types to each map. The data and tech available are limited, but we can make the most of what we can use. First, we will set up for a generic environment type for desert and an element type wind in Wise for the generic default map Met L3. First, we'll add the wildlife content. In the Project Explorer, under the Audio tab, Locate the Actor Mixer default work unit, then select the Environment Wise work unit. Right click, then select New Child Actor Mixer. Name the new Actor Mixer EMV underscore Desert. Next, we'll add a container that randomly plays one shot insect assets. Right click the Environment underscore Desert Actor Mixer, then select New Child Random Container. Name it EMV underscore Desert underscore Insect. In the Properties Editor General Settings tab, change the Play Mode to Continuous. Tick the Loop box, also leave as Infinite. Tick the Transition box. In Type, select Trigger Rate from the drop down menu. Then in Duration, change the value to 5. Double click the Duration Randomizer. Then in the Windowed Properties, we will define an offset value. Tick Enabled. Leave Min Offset at 0. Then change the max offset to 4. Close the randomizer window. Right click the EMV underscore desert underscore insect random container and add two new random containers. Name them EMV underscore desert underscore insect underscore crickets and EMV underscore desert underscore insect underscore fly. Import audio asset one shots for the crickets and the flies in the associated container. Place them in a new folder under SFX Environment Insects. Now press play on the transport control. The play function should stay continuous, triggering insect assets every five to nine seconds. Let us add a mammal type too. Copy and paste the EMV underscore desert underscore insect random container to the same location under EMV underscore desert. Rename the random container EMV underscore desert underscore mammal. Name the child random container under this container to match the hierarchy plus add the mammal type name. Then delete the insect audio assets from the duplicated container. For now, copy and paste the placeholder underscore silence underscore one underscore shot test asset under each random container. Now we'll add a new generic wind type element to support the desert ambience. Under the actor mixer hierarchy, default work unit element wise work unit, add a new actor mixer under the wind work unit called ELM underscore wind underscore warm. Copy the EMV underscore desert underscore insects random container and place it under the ELM underscore wind underscore warm actor mixer. Rename the random container ELM underscore wind underscore warm underscore gust underscore sand. Remove the two child random containers. Then import one shot light sand wind gust audio assets. Place them in a new folder, SFX, Element, Wind. Also, let's import a looping wind asset under the ELM underscore wind underscore warm actor mixer. Implement the loop into the same location as the WIM warm folder. Select the WIM warm loop audio asset, then in the properties editor, select the loop tick box. Now test the loop and the one shots that they trigger correctly with the transport control play function. Now we need to associate our two new environment and element actor mixers to an audio bus. Select the ELM underscore wind underscore warm act mixer. In the properties editor general settings tab output bus, click on the path UI button. 
Then navigate and select the Environment Bus, Master Audio Bus, SFX, Element. Then click OK. Select the EMV underscore Desert Actor Mixer. Then in the Properties Editor General Settings tab Output Bus, click on the Path UI button. Then navigate to and select the Environment Bus. Then click OK. Lastly, we associate all the new content we have implemented to a single WISE event. First, we are going to configure the WISE windows to be more useful. In the WISE toolbar, select Views, Project Explorer, Project Explorer Sync Group 2. This brings up a duplicated window of the hierarchy. In this window, change to the Audio tab and leave this extra window open. Return to the main WISE window. Right click the Wind Warm Loop Audio Asset. Then select New Event, then Play. In the Project Explorer Events tab, Find the new sound event in the default work unit. Name the sound event SFX underscore EMV underscore desert underscore generic. Drag it into the environment wise work unit. Now in the events editor, right click, then add three new action play types. In the duplicated project explorer window that we opened in point one, find the EML wind underscore warm underscore gust underscore sand random container. Then select and drag it onto the event editor target column on the second play blank type. Repeat the process with the EMV underscore desert underscore insect and the EMV underscore desert underscore mammal. Finally, for each of the play events, we need to change a few properties for the looping assets. Select the play wind warm loop line. In the properties, change the fade time to 0.5. Select the new SFX underscore EMV underscore desert underscore generic event. Now press play. Hopefully you will hear all the assets implemented, looping and randomly triggering one shots. Change the sound bank layout. Drag the new event SFX underscore EMV underscore desert underscore generic into the main sound bank. Generate the sound banks and save your WISE project updates. Now we need to implement the new SFX underscore EMV underscore desert underscore generic WISE event to trigger in the default map MET L3. Find the MET L3.cfg script file under cube slash cube slash packages slash base. In the map script, in a new line, add AK event space SFX underscore EMV underscore desert underscore generic. Save the script update, then close the script window. Finally, let us test the new environment in game. Boot up the cube game. You should hear all environment desert components being triggered as soon as you boot up the game. Connect wires to the game. Change the profile layout. You should now see a live list of all components being triggered. Close the game. As a final test, run a wires integrity report. If any errors are highlighted to the name content we have added in this guide, check the guide again for any missed points. You have now implemented your first environment type. Take 30 minutes to volume balance and mix the components of the desert environment. Try pitching the fly or the cricket assets up a semitone or two. Also try adding a random pitch or random volume with each asset triggered. Once you've got to grips with all the above processes, use this guide to start implementing new environment types for different maps.